Hulk. It's Brazil breaking forward. And the cross comes in now. Good hands, bread and butter work, really, by the goalkeeper. But he did it very confidently. He's having a good game. Coutinho. Lucas. Johnny Kroos. This is fascinating, and the crowd are loving the, the drama that we're watching here. Just a one goal in it in favour of the home team. Yeah, careful that they don't start celebrating too quickly and that the players feel they've won the game before they actually have. And it's Cristiano Ronaldo stepping in for Real Madrid. Here's the cross. The counter-attack could be on here because it was a poor ball and they've got some pre-possession and a chance to get numbers forward he's cut out the pass intercepting if you like and now it could be a chance goal And scores from the spot. Not about the keeper. He's dived out the way, I think. Because he's hit it with such power. Modric. Here we are with just three minutes remaining. Modric. Cristiano Ronaldo. The shot's on. It's a good block. He can hit it here. Modric. And there it is for Real Madrid. The goal for Modric. And the way he's guided that to the left-hand side of the goal, well, it's wonderful technique. Plenty of goals for the fans here, 4-2. Here we go again. We go back to the goalkeeper here, can't blame him for that. Shots on here. Well, the goal scored by the side with the extra man, and they've made that extra man count. Well, you've got to use the width of the pitch. And make that extra man count, as you say, Martin. They did exactly that, and they were patient. They waited for the moment, and they got the reward. This has been a treat to watch. A fantastic spectacle. So many goals. I wonder whether the goalkeeper can get his head to this corner. It is a corner, and they'll pile men into the penalty area. Diego Alves! That's a brilliant goal. Well, this team just won't lie down, will they? I thought they were down and out, two behind, but back on level terms. 